Hey what's up coders, in today's video I am going to show how to add icon inside input field. So recently some followers asking to make video on how to add icon in input box. And I think I should make video on it. And it is pretty simple to do that by some CSS. So without wasting any time, let's dive into. First of all, we need a HTML file, which I already created here. And after that, I am going to add HTML like this way and now going to change title icon input field and after doing these initial things we are going to add icon library of font awesome and we are going to use font awesome library cdn so just search for font awesome cdn and you have to click on this link and after that just copy this link and you may now we have to paste in the head tag like this way so our font awesome library is added here and this is the CDN link. So CDN is the fast library delivery method which will not slow down the website too much. And after that I am going to continue my code like H3 tab and I am going to now input my heading input field with icon and after that I am going to add a form there with the class inline and inside a form I am going to add a div with class input icon. So after that we need to add icons and the input field. And to add icons, we need to search for Font Awesome website and click on icons. So here you need to search for the icons, anyone like I am going to search user icon. And here you can see the list of icons like these are pro icons and these are free. Click on it and then you need to copy this one. Just click on it and it will be copied, pasted in your code like this way and the input field like this way. So I can give the class as well like this input field so our icon and input field is done now it's time to see it on front end so as you can see it is showing like this way and now i am going to put inside this input field so as you can see our icon is showing like this way and now i am going to put this icon inside my input field so to add this icon inside this input field we need some css which is necessary part of this video so now we are going to add style tag in the head section like this way and first of all I am going to style my form for now. So copy the class name and paste it here like this way and give it max width 400 pixel and the margin 0 auto. So after that refresh your front end like this way and it is centered now and after that duplicate these two lines like this way. So now I am going to change the icon name like envelope. I know the icon name as well and refresh it so you can see it is changed and it's time to give it some style copy it paste it here and put the dot before the class so give it width 100% give it padding 10% is enough and text line center margin bottom 4 pixel save it and refresh it again so now it is looking pretty good so now I am going to give some style which will put the icon inside the input field. So I am going to copy this class for some reference like this way. And now I am going to copy this class. So it is same on both icons. That's why I am copying like this way. And it's time to give some style. So I am going to give it position absolute. So position absolute will centerize the icon inside the input field and by default we have the position relative on the outer div so no need to give it position relative if i refresh it now the icon is inside but not the centerized so it's time to center it so there are two ways either we can give it bottom or top attribute or we can give it padding so let's give it padding 10 pixel and min width 40 pixel save it and refresh it again so now you can see our icon is centerized. So let's give it color. My favorite color is black, but I am going to give it some something else. Save it, refresh. So you can see the color is changed. Let's try with background color, blue. So now you can see it is uh, the color we have applied. We can also style it by some CSS. So there are a few steps that you need to follow. You need to add a library. And then with the position absolute and some style you need to centerize the icon so it is pretty easy to apply this way 
So guys, I hope you must find this video useful and don't forget to like, subscribe and share. Finally, thanks for watching.